as PM has said, all essential services will continue to operate. Let me list down the following essential services that we can expect to see continue operations. First, all healthcare and social services. Second, all food-related services. Third, energy. Fourth, water and waste management and environmental services. Fifth, all transportation, storage and logistics services. Sixth, all information and communication services. Seven, all security operations. Eight, all facilities management and critical public infrastructure. Nine, manufacturing activities that are essential to our security, sustenance and safety. Ten, all banking and financial services. A number of other services, including hardware stores for repairs, pet supplies, vehicle recovery, will also be allowed to continue operations. However, all these businesses will operate with the core essential staff and are expected to comply with the strict safe distancing measures. Let me also say that all the related supply chains to keep the essential services functioning will also be allowed to continue. Our agencies will proactively inform the firms that provide essential services if they have not already done so. Other companies can contact us for clarification and assistance as necessary. We will set up a hotline from tonight to take queries from the business community. The hotline will run from 8 p.m. until midnight tonight and begin operations again at 8 a.m. tomorrow morning. The number to call is 6898-1800. I will put all this information on the website after the news conference. There is also a website for businesses to go to to get more information and to provide the details required and to submit appeals as necessary. This website will be covid.gobusiness.gov.sg covid.gobusiness.gov.sg All businesses that can be done from home all operations that can be done from home without the need to commute will also be able to continue. Businesses that are critical to the functioning of the global supply chains will also be able to continue. For example, companies that are involved in the manufacturing of semiconductor, biopharma, petrochemicals will be allowed to continue. And likewise, their associated supply chains will also be allowed to continue. Business operations like construction that require some time to wind down safely will be given a short grace period to do so over the next few days. Music